We are not looking for an ordinary leader or an ordinary manager or administrator. We are looking for the President of the Philippines. So, I think there should be international stature that would be of great help to Philippine foreign and domestic policy. But more importantly, I repeat, there are three qualifications to become President. Academic excellence. Ako, may doctorate ako in juridical science from America. Tsaka valedictorian ako ng lahat ng klase ko. Hindi naman pwede na yung naupo sa likod, yun ang magiging presidente ng Pilipinas. Professional excellence. Binigyan ako ng prestigious Magsaysay Award for Government Service. Quote, for bold and moral leadership in cleaning up a corrupt government agency. Meron ba silang ganon? Third, moral excellence. Maliban dyan sa dalawang excellences na yon, meron pang moral excellence which is the most important. Unfortunately, there is no machine that you can attach to a human being so that you can tell whether that person is honest or not. Maaring bulero lang, maaring magaan ng bibig, maaring kung ano nung sinasabi, basta kung unang dumating sa isipan niya. Kaya pag-isipan nyo mabuti itong ginagawa natin. Nagpipili tayo ng ating maging leader sa loob ng sunod na anim na taon. Hindi tayo pwede mamili sa base lang ng kursunada o dahil uso doon sa mga mga gang ninyo sa mga tribes ninyo sa eskwela. We are all united in this endeavor to improve and reform the Philippines. Akala ng iba, palaking ganito na lang tayo. Hindi. Lalabanan natin itong korupsyon na naging bunga at sanhi ng ating kahirapan. For those who think that I should withdraw because I have once been a cancer patient, this is what I say. I am now normal. I can think and I can act and I can pray. I will never quit. I will never stop. I will never!